Hi guys, my name's Aaron, and um, I'm really sorry that I haven't made a video in a while. Um, I've been quite busy with exams, but I hope you enjoyed the last um, headcam video I made. Um, that is actually quite popular, it's got uh, about 800 views in three days, which uh, for my standard is quite good. Um, so this video is really just an update video. Um, I haven't really been showing many of my guns. Um, I promised that I would have done, I was going to do the tactical loadout series, and I was doing them. But some, uh, quite a lot has changed actually, I've got different gear and everything, and these are two new guns that I've got. So I thought I'd just update you on the guns. Um, it's coming soon, full, full reviews and accuracy tests out of both these guns, both very special. So I'll start with the one at the bottom. This was the most expensive one, it's a Tokyo Marui um, SOP Mod M4. It's essentially a um, M4A1 with um, an RIS um, system at the front. Um, this gun... Um, is a very good gun, it's really high end, it's the one with the blowback. Um, if I give you a quick demonstration of this, um, you can see it moves back every time you uh, fire, especially on a fully automatic. Hold on a minute, here we go. So this um, is not stock, it's been upgraded with a just uh, an Eagle 6 um, M100 spring, it's uh, putting out just under 350 at the last chrono, it went um, 347, 348 and 347 again I think um, on a Madable Chrono at um, Rebel Skirmish, that was when I last skirmished if you see the video. Um, strapped on it, all I've got is a EOTech 552 clone, very good replica and um, an Element um, M961 flashlight, or, no M951 sorry. Um, full review will be done there because it's a very nice flashlight, good for um, blinding enemies. It's had um, the buffer tube and the um, RAS system um, done up because if you haven't uh, heard of it the SOT mods have a lot, uh, well not a lot of problems but certain problems which need to be fixed before you can really get the full potential out of it. So that's the M4. So now here's my um, new sniper rifle. Um, if you know me, uh, my name is Aaron the Airsoft Sniper. Um, haven't actually been sniping. I, I sold my, my original sniper rifle a while ago. I just, just didn't get on with it. But this gun, this has got the full works in it. I got the second hand. Um, hence the sort of paint job is kind of peeling off, you can see the black and then the OD. Um, I, I think it's okay for me, um, I'm going to be wrapping it in ghillie anyway, uh, natural foliage. Um, just use, it's quite simple, just use elastic bands, put that on. It's got a mammoth of a scope on it, it's a JSR 3 to 9 by 50 illuminator scope and it's got, um, what do you call it, um, mill dots in the, in the reticle. Let's quickly give you a demonstration of that, if I can get the scope in view. Wow, there you go. There we go. Um, it's resting on a, a Harris style bipod attached to the bipod lug. Um, unfortunately, stuff went wrong with this. Um, it's missing a mag catch, so I have to currently hold the mag uh, the mags in, but I'm trying to get hold of them. They're pretty rare to find. I don't know why Tokyo Marines don't make them, but it's a really nice sniper rifle. Um, it's got a whole load of upgrades in it. Um, at the moment, I don't know on the top of my head, but in the, in the review, I'll, sh oh, I'll tell you all the um, upgrades in it. It's a Tokyo Marie uh, VSR 10G spec, if I didn't sell it already. Um, it's actually a really nice uh, gun. I've been shooting the uh, longest distance I have, about 200 feet um, at a bin, which is it's about a man-sized target. It's quite it's wider than a man, a man I guess, um, but it's uh, shorter as well. It's been hitting that about four out of five times, and the one out of five, that, that shot just went to the left or the right. Um, so, you know, it's really nice scopes, perfect, it's illuminated, everything's great. Been using 0.25s because it's only, it's only shooting um, just under 360. The spring is, uh, it's all got the Lalax upgrades in it as well as type bore, which goes into the silencer. So, I hope you enjoy this video. Um, just a quick update for my subscribers, really. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Um, all these um, reviews will be made soon because I have a, a week off for my exams, um, half term. So I'll be making all the videos then, so thanks for watching, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.